Hello, hello. What's going on, YouTube? Rashad is back. Guys, it is cloudy. It's raining here in Camp Hill, PA. Not a big fan of this weather, but hey, you know, gotta be thankful though at the same time. Um, because rain is good. We need rain. But yeah, I just wanna hop on here real quick and just, you know, talk about the enemy, you know, and 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 how he wants to destroy this. You know, something I realize is the enemy is constantly trying to work in our mind. If he can get if he can get into our mind, if he can get into our thoughts, if he can cause us to believe lies, man, he can he can control us. He can control our lives. So, you know, he tries to create strongholds and you know, these strongholds, guys, it, it produces guilt, shame, fear, uh, condemnation anxiety you name it you know and these must be broken in the name of jesus you know and and the enemy is very slick he's very crafty and it's something that we have to be aware of you know and allow christ to renew our minds right you know the bible says be transformed by the renewing of your mind so transformation guys is when we renew our minds we got to renew our minds because the enemy wants us to believe lies, but God wants us to believe truth, okay? You know, God wants us to believe who he says we are, who we are in Christ. And as we renew our minds, transformation is going to take place, you know, and those strongholds will be broken in the name of Jesus, you know? And that's something that I see in my life, guys. Like, you know, I'm not there yet. You know, I got some, some things that need to be broken, you know, and, you know, I just want to be free in my mind and I'm not completely there yet, but... You know, this life is a journey, it's a process, and, you know, be encouraged. Don't be hard on yourself. Show yourself grace and forgiveness and preach to myself too. But, you know, it's very important that we show the same grace and forgiveness that God shows us in Christ. You know, the enemy wants us to beat ourselves up, be discouraged, and, and all that. Because he can, he'll do anything to get us down that wrong path, yo. <laughs> yo, I don't know why I just said that, but, but yeah, guys. Um, that just wanted to be a quick video, be encouraged and, uh, you know, God loves us all. God is for us all. God has a plan and no matter what the world looks like, his plan will come to fruition. His will will be done and we can have faith and trust in that, that God is in the details, you know, and it's so important to not look at what we see, but look at what we can't see. All right, that's it for today. Y'all have a good day. And uh, yeah, enjoy the, the littlest, littlest things in life because those are the best. Thanks.